When you're learning about anatomy, it's important to know how to talk about where structures are located in the body and the different ways of viewing the body. Anatomical position is used to describe any region or part of the body in reference to a specific stance. As you can see in the gross anatomy model here, the body is lying flat. The upper limbs are at the sides and the palms are facing forward. The feet are flat and directed forward. When the body is lying face up, this is called supine position. When the body is lying face down, this is called prone position. Note that anatomical position doesn't have to be supine, the head and limbs just need to be arranged correctly. Directional terms are used to describe the position of one structure relative to another, or relative to the midline of the body, which is an imaginary line that divides the body down the middle. Medial refers to structures closer to the midline, like the medial compartment of the thigh. And lateral refers to structures further from it, like the lateral compartment of the lower leg. Directional terms are pretty much all paired in a similar way. Distal refers to what's far away from the origin of a structure, and proximal is what's close to that origin. You can see that the distal phalanges in the hands and feet are further out towards the end of the limbs than the proximal phalanges. Superficial refers to structures closer to the surface of the body, that is, the skin, while deep refers to structures further from the surface, deeper inside. As we dissect structures away, we go from more superficial to more deep ones. You can use directional terms to describe particular views of the body as well. For example, anterior refers to structures located at or near the front of the body, while posterior refers to structures located at or near the back of the body. Similarly, superior refers to structures that are closer to the head, and inferior refers to structures further from the head, or closer to the feet. A superior view is a bird's eye view, looking down, an inferior view shows the body from the bottom up. Planes are ways of dividing up the body and its internal structures using imaginary flat surfaces. You can imagine them like panes of glass. When you're selecting the depth for a 3D drawing in Human Anatomy Atlas, you're selecting the plane you want to draw on. The frontal, or coronal plane, divides the body into anterior and posterior portions. The transverse plane divides the body into superior and inferior portions. The sagittal plane vertically divides the body into right and left sides. The mid-sagittal plane is a specific slice right at the midline that divides the body evenly into right and left sides. The oblique plane passes through the body anywhere at an angle. Explore our vast library of 3D gross and microanatomy models, as well as diagnostic images and cross-sections, with Visible Body Web Suite. Start a 7-day free trial today at visiblebody.com slash web suite.